Hi there, Andy Hunt here for our Andrew Music channel. Welcome to my channel. This is number three in the Undiscovered My Songwriting Journey series. So this next song uh, that I'm going to be doing today is called I'm Going to Be Me. And a uh, little bit about this story, this song. So this was written, uh, I have here, again, in my ye old uh, song notebook in uh, January 8th, 1983 is when I wrote this song. Uh, it's called I'm Going to Be Me. Uh, story behind this song, I guess, um, if you were listening to the, uh, the last one, uh, written about a month before this, it was a dark time in my life. So this next one is, uh, I'm going to be a, me, it was sort of the uh, em empowerment uh, coming out of the bad time, uh, and it's about, um, it's about not wanting to be um, put on a shelf, not wanting to be put in a mold. It's trying to stand up for yourself uh, at the time. I kind of have felt pressure from different, uh, we'll get into the details, but to conform to certain groups and not, not other groups, um, so to speak. So in terms of songwriting, uh, pretty simple chords. Uh, and I was, again, this is my third song. Um, up until this point, um, I'm still writing basically the way that acoustic guitar um, at the time, I, I don't think I had an electric guitar. I might have just got my first electric guitar. So I was playing acoustic guitar, and most of the influence uh, at the time was sort of strummy um, acoustic uh, music. And so that was the, the musical inspiration for this. Uh, simple song, um, three verses and a chorus. Uh, again, early in my songwriting, so I had not um, kind of discovered the the importance of the uh, middle eight or the bridge uh, section of a song. Um, I do something a little bit different in the third verse than the other two verses, but not a lot different. So in my songwriting journey, I'm still kind of trying to understand the, the format of, of writing, a, uh, writing a song, sticking to the verse, chorus, verse, chorus, verse, chorus uh, process. But um, anyway, so, so this is a relatively simple song. Um, and uh, I'll let you determine for yourself what you think the, the influences um, are. But uh, it's called I'm Gonna Be Me. It goes uh, a little something like this. Every 
time, all the time, every time. I want to be proud of who I can be all the time, every time, every time, every time. So that uh, was the third song that I uh, ever wrote. Um, and uh, so the life of this song after I wrote it was basically, I don't know that anybody outside of my family and maybe not even my family has heard this. Uh, this was one of those songs that I, it was very personal at the time, um, January 1983. And uh, I, I don't, I don't think I felt like uh, it was really good enough to be shared with a band, or uh, I actually was not in a band at this point. I had not joined my first band, but uh, it was a way of for me to express myself. So early on in my songwriting career, it was really just about uh, personal expression. So this was uh, called I'm Gonna Be Me, and uh, I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to hit the subscribe uh, button. And uh, hit the like button if you liked it. Make some comments if you like. Uh, and I will see you for the next installment. And until then, here's to the creative process. And I'll see you next time. Bye.